Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome back to another episode of our Yakuza 4 Remastered Let's Play. On to episode 2. Um, kind of wish that I knew there was just like a little bit of walking and a few more, a little bit more of a cutscene, and then the chapter ended. Before I did my initial cut, so I don't look like an idiot. But that's in the past now, isn't it? Anyways, we're going to get straight on to chapter two. So if you guys are excited, you know, let me know with a like. Leave me a comment. It's going to help. We're going to save for the first time after I click back over here because I was messing around with Pokey Clicker. The one. Yeah. Almost guy on the street. Can't have to do that. You're gonna make me want to go on. Wait. No. That's Akiyama-sama. This is when the tower exploded in Kiwami 1. Oh. 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 Hey, you there. Wake up. Free to go. On your feet. Okay. Good thing you had a witness. You better thank Calabai Deluxe for your, from your office, from saving your ass. Are you talking about Hanachan? The girl was half mad, drenched to the bone by the time she got to the precinct. Kept shouting, Chief didn't do it. <laughs> that right. Hey, Akiyama. Stay away from those Kanemura dart bags. Got it? Might think you're some kind of saint. Giving handouts to any old schmuck off the street. All you're doing is stirring up trouble. Just keep your pretty little face out of our way. Got that? What are you getting at? You splash cash like it's some kind of game. You're fueling more crime. A game, huh? You heard me. That shooting? We all know you're mixed up in it all. You stirred up a horde incest with Kanamura. Don't be surprised when he gets stung. Uchi-san. I have my own reasons for what I do. Why I lend to who I lend to. So I'm not planning to close up shop. Are we done? I have places to be. Kanemura is dead. When? While you were sleeping like a baby. Listen, keep your paws out of this business with Kanemura and the... You know, Siwa. That foot near Kanamura's boys again, and we'll hang you out the dry. Scout's honor. I don't know why I know, I don't recognize your face, but I don't. But I recognize the name. I don't know why. It is bothering me.
Oh, Chief. I finally got a hold of you. I'm so glad you're out. I thought you'd be in the slammer for weeks, months, maybe even years. Uh, Hanachan, you know I was only in there for questioning, right? They didn't actually arrest me. Whatever it was, I'm so relieved. All that running I did down this to the station paid off. Yeah, and you really came through for me, Hanachan. I appreciate it. <laughs> By the way, Chief. While you've been lounging around in jail, work's been piling up like there's no tomorrow. Get back to the office now. Hanachan, please. I barely slept a week last night. I'm seriously wiped out here. And whose fault is that, hmm? All that nonsense yesterday could have been avoided if you just did your job. Don't let me down this time, Chief. We have tons of work to do. Anishan. Hello? You hung up on me. Might as well head back to the Sky Finance. Or... Oh, that's the taxi symbol. I was about to say, what is that logo? Or, wait. Or was there two? Oh. Places where you can go up. Huh. Interesting. But we don't have anything that's blocking our way. So as it stands, we can do a little bit of running around. Can I see what's going on here? Aniki, how about we play some Mojong? Where is Orchid Pash Mojong is holding a tournament? Oh yeah? Yeah, you know, the magazine Modern Mojong, they're holding some kind of contest to find the best Mojong player in the country. And Orchid Palace is taking part. Heh. <laughs> Sounds fun. They let any old Mog off the street join up? Pretty sure. Orchid Palace is, here is working hard to figure out who's the top Mojong dog in Kamarocho. Well, obviously it's me. Now let's show those bitches how it's done. Got it? Okay. Since we got free roam around the city, I got completely turned around. Got a... Uh, Camaro Catsul there with the HLA. I wonder if they're still active. But, um... Let's see what trouble we can get ourselves into. If any. I see blue. You. I thought I'd be living the dream, huh? Why do I look so down? Well, came all the way here to find the land... To the land of cherry blossom trees to study Japanese. Half the people in this town don't even speak it. Especially when you go west of the Champion District, Little Asia. What's Asia doing in my Japan? Oh, I tried to go in, but they yelled at me for some, in some foreign language and shoot me a range. Shoot me away. This is Japan. Speak Japanese. The gatekeepers at entrances to Little Asia uh, don't speak Japanese. However, a character who can speak other prominent Asian languages, such as Chinese, Korean, or Tagalog, might be able to walk their way in. Just so once I master Japanese, I'll start learning Chinese. I can't anything be easy. Okay, so it's more of a... Okay. We're telling me like there's stuff to do that way later on. I know there was uh, someone here. Rooftop must exist so you can get a better look at the sky. I mean, you, you get your run of the mill weirdos up there too, but they almost add to the wonder of sky top sky gazing. First place is Camarocho. The rooftops are divided into southwest and southeast areas. These areas can be used as alternate routes to. Typical street loot. Rooftop entrances and exits are marked on your map. However, most building managers deem it too dangerous when it's raining and it will close off the rooftop entrances in wet weather. Okay. So that's what the up arrow's for. So let's go. And explore.
maybe find some keys. I don't know if it's too early for that yet. Oh. This is pretty. Looking for anything shiny. Nothing that I can see. Okay, this is... This is pretty cool. Whoa. Hold on. I realize I didn't get a screenshot for last episode. Millennium Tower. There's Camarocho Hills. Ah. Oh. Interesting. This is all pretty cool. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, I don't want to go that way because that's the way it kind of wants me to go. But this is really damn cool. Holy hell. Like, oh, this is, oh, we're right above theater. Oh. Okay. Oh. Okay, this is, I like this a lot. I like this a lot. I don't know what the full advantage is. Maybe just avoiding fights when unwanted. That's that's it's pretty cool. What do you have to say? Sometimes they hand out special editions of Tokyo Sports around here. Of course, they don't hand them out unless something big happens. So if you manage to get ones, it feels like you're there for a historic moment. When something remarkable happens, special editions of magazines are distributed in Theater Square. There's no telling when they'll be handed out, so keep checking Theater Square. So I can never stop circling Kamarucho. I gotta have them all. Look for experiences. Oh, oh, I see shiny. So thirsty. I think I drank too much. I feel sick. Hey, you there. You think you gave me something to drink? Don't worry. Uh, I don't expect you to do it for free. I'll pay you back. You always treat me nice. So I owe you anyways. I'll be waiting right here for that drink. First we grab the first key. And... Let's get this... Well, hold on first. This... No, it's not even a sub-story. Not that that's the only reason I'm doing it, of course. I mean... It would be so shallow just to do something simply for a sub-story because it's needed to fight Joe Amon at the end of the game. Because you always fight Joe Amon at the end of the game. Not me, of course. I'm a nice guy. Completely nice guy. Oh, uh, water. Yeah. Oh, still can't look at the manga rack. I miss being able to do that. Alright. It's always fun just like in like actual like old shonen jump covers or shonen magazine covers. Is it I know they did that in it was Zero Kwami and Two. So I think five starts the dragon engine again if I remember correctly. So maybe when we get back back to five we can do it again maybe take the water thank you i need you to come through i got you back no matter what happens i'll be here if you ever get caught in a fight nearby by the way you know about the dragon palace dragon palace isn't that some famous castle or something nah it's a little hangout spot for us home we get together and run up some games of chance Think of it like an arcade, but for grown-ups. 
Never heard about it when I was homeless. That's, uh, well, the building just north of east of here. The place was abandoned in the middle of getting built up. You're a good guy. I'll tell him to let you in. I, you definitely gotta stop by. I see. Thanks for that. I'll check it out sometime. Well, the Dragon Palace didn't exist when you were a homeless guy. I was still a bit of a ways away. I was gonna say, you look like you want to throw hands. Which I will happily oblige. It's the fighting music. Pretty dope. I've never seen anyone use a wrench as a weapon in these games. Interesting. Up. Up, up, up. Question is, is do you pick up weapons when you're... I don't need to spam the button because that's just gonna finish it. Yes. Oh, that was the broken wrench. I was trying to pick it up because I thought someone else dropped it. Oh well. Pop, pop, pop. Pop, pop. Pop, pop. Okay. Nice little quick uh, special combo with the Y button. Ow, oh, ow. I'll scrape the cash on my own. I'm real sorry. As you'll watch, that's something I can probably sell. You see? That's the garbage. What? Let's see. Any shiny here in the park? I don't even know if there's any sub-stories in, like, available yet. I'm curious. Give me a moment. Okay, I looked it up. Um, gotta meet someone named Lily, apparently, for sub-stories to actually begin. So we've been running around for nothing for the better part of 20 minutes. Oh, well. We're gonna talk to this person, and then we're gonna, um, continue on with the chapter. I send, like, 100 emails a day, so listen when I tell you this. Keep your emails organized by folder, that way you won't be all flustered when you get, like, 40 at once. In addition to receiving emails from the people you know, you can, may also res receive easy emails packed with useful information from that into time. The emails that you receive are separated into categories based on the sender, making it easy to find specific messages. Most for plenty emails from hosts, be sure to keep an eye out on any messages and reply quickly. He replied right away. I'm going to do the same. Okay. Good to know, I guess. Hey, it's, it, it, it gives me free experience. I don't want to go in there. So back to the office. No, I do not want to fight you. I go in from the front. This is New Serena. There's some scary looking people that come here from time to time and it's members only, so it's hard to go in. Oh, so the elevator only goes up to New Serena and not the whole floor. They clean up the... Oh, well, that was quick. I think they at least throw a way uh, out of order sign on it because you know I would think you know, the bullet would have cracked some of the product in there in the machine. Okay, we're we're back at the office. Where's uh? 
Hi, John. Hmm? Hmm? Don't forget to eat, Chief. Ice cold. Only because we took so long to get here. Do not have a microwave in here? Mm. Where did I put that lighter? The hell? Do I have a spare around here? Stupid. So was that a glimpse, glimpse at his life before he was homeless? Excuse me. Ah, uh, oh, hello there. How can I help you? Come in, come in. Um. Hey. Yes? Looking for Sky Finance. Am I in the right place? You are. Sorry, I know it's a bit of a hassle to find. Please, please, have a seat. Thank you. So, yes? Are you here or alone? Yes, I... Is the girl from the photo? Yes. Um... Yeah? Do you mind if I smoke? Oh, not at all. Go right ahead. Sorry about the mess. My secretary usually handles the customers. Never think to clean this stuff up. She doesn't recognize who I am? Be my guest. Thank you. Now, uh... Hi. Yes? About that loan you wanted. Um... Oh yes, the truth is... Um... Go on. Well, um... I heard you offer limitless loans. No guarantor, no collateral needed. Is that true? Limitless, huh? Where did you hear that? Can't say, huh? Well, it's fine. Imagine some other lender who turned you down pointed you my way. Could you a like, we can't give you a loan, but Sky Finance just might. That and a half dozen other things, I bet. It's not exactly popular with the rest of the industry, you see. Hey. 
How much do you need? Um. I don't. Light that. Mind if I borrow your lighter? Yes, be my guest. Drama queen. Sorry. You don't see many places with names like that in Kamurocho. Is that where you work? Oh, no. That is, I don't work there anymore. We've been in the business long? Yes, a while, I suppose. So, name your figure. There's no way I can help you if you don't tell me how much you need. Hundred million. That's the amount in cash within the next ten days, if at all possible. A hundred million. Yes, sir. And your guarantor? I don't have one. Any collateral? No, sir. It's a hefty amount. No guarantor, no collateral. You want it all at once in cash. You realize how much you're asking for? I'm sorry, this is crazy. I should have never brought it up. It's foolish of me to impose. Please, just forget this ever happened. I'm sorry to have wasted your time. Now if you'll excuse me. Hold on. I never said I wouldn't loan you the, lend you the money. But let's sit and talk about this over tea. Now, here's the deal. We require each of our clients to pass a test before we finance their loans. Test? That's right. Test the gauge whether or not we can trust you. Trust me. Yep. We test all of our customers before agreeing to a loan, uh, agreeing to loan them anything. We had one person care for the elderly for a week and another pick up litter, old litter in Kamarocho. We even had women work in the red light district. That's get more difficult depending on the loan amount and terms. And in your case, well, the test will be hard. You got it. But if you pass, I promise to loan you the amount you want under the terms you specified. What's the test going to be? Those are my terms. You can't pass the test. I'm afraid I can't offer you the loan. About the 10 days you mentioned. Do you really need the money that soon? I do. Pretty big hurry, huh? Yes, that's right. But if you don't pass my test, you'll have wasted some of that precious time. What do you think? Still want to give it a shot? Yes. 
やらせてください。I have to try. 本当にいいんですね。And you're really、sure? 私にはもう他の選択肢はないです。The only I お願いします。Oh, please. そのテスト。Let me take your test. 受けさせてください。He's determined. All right. Mind if I take this? Go right ahead. I、right, finance. Oh, this is. Is this Akiyama san? Kido chan. Where are you? Is everything okay? Down at the Kamaracha precinct, they just finished grilling me about Kanamura san. Kanamura? What are they doing questioning you? I'm the one who found him. Walked back to, into the office, and there he was, dead. Or you had to see that, but hey, this isn't exactly, hasn't been exactly smooth sailing on my end either. Speaking of, I take it you've heard about R.A. san by now? Yeah. Some detective named Siguchi told me. I still can't wrap my head around it. Me neither. Listen, we shouldn't talk about this stuff over the phone. Free to meet up? You free to meet up later? Yeah. I got some questions I want to ask you two. Sure thing. You can call me back in a few, though. I'm kind of finishing up with a customer. Oh, yeah, no problem. Talk to you soon. Sorry about that. Seems another one of my customers is an event and pitch. It's fine. So, back to business. 10 days, 100 million yen. That's right. Understood. In that case, can I ask you to swing by again tomorrow? I'm gonna need a little time to mull, mull that test over. Okay. I'm prepared, though. We'll be starting right when you get here. I will. I'll be back tomorrow. Looking forward to it. Hey, uh. Your name. Never asked you your name. Lily. It's Lily. Lily san. That's your real name? Or just the one you use at work? Does it really matter either way? No. Yes, it doesn't. See you tomorrow. Fall back, Kido, I guess? It's Akiyama. Sorry to spring this on you at last minute, but I'm gonna bring a new girl into the club. She starts tomorrow. But if she actually shows up, that is. Rearrange the shifts, shuffle things around. I don't care how you do it, just make it work. Look, know how to run my business. Besides, I've already made up my mind. Don't let me down. Later. The ball's in her court now. Oh, Chief! You actually decided to show up today. Good to see you too, Hana Chan. Sweet. Hide out. Excellent. That means I can go back and do. Um. And get that screenshot. So, okay, we're about 30 minutes in. I'm gonna step in here. Get that to save. So, do you want give me a few moments? Because I want to get that screenshot. Because I'm not sure exactly what I'm going to be doing next. If it's gonna be some sub stories or what. So, um. Give me a moment. Again. Okay, we're back. Um.
instantly got another got the phone call. So um Yeah, let's go for it. Hello? Yeah, Amazon, it's me. Is now a good time? Yep. We're all in the clear. What's up? There's something I gotta talk to you about. Might if we meet up for a few? Not at all. We're at. How about that building in Theater Square? You know, the red one down the alley? Oh, some privacy there. Anyway, it's the one right across from the movie theater. I'll be waiting up on the roof. Roof of the red building. Got it. Perfect. See you there. We'll just continue to the, through the story. For now. Oh, and now sub stories open up. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Let's see. We're a good amount of the way through this chapter. I mean, so what I'll do is I'll shorten this. I just realized this is on, on a this is a Yakuza Friday episode. I just realized having Pokemon at the first half of the week is throwing me off. Um. So what we'll do is we'll cut it here. Actually, we'll do all of these sub stories that we have available to us through the next couple of episodes because I want to kind of clear through these as quickly as possible. And then we will finish up with the back half of the actually I got a crazy idea I got a crazy idea we're going to take another quick pause I'm going to do sub stories I'm going to record the next episode next couple episodes and then come back to here. So, hate to do this so many times, but I want to try to keep the stories more together this time around. So, I will see you in a... Yes. Alrighty, I'm back. Um, in a couple hours, um... The next two episodes are recorded. I even made myself some dinner in the and then here we are. Finishing off chapter two. Just chapter two, right? Yeah, chapter two. Up here, yep. Go to the rooftop. This doesn't say hey, the chapter's ending here shortly. I don't know what is. This brace, love, brace. Oh, Arianaki, you really did it, huh? I couldn't believe it either. Our eye sounds too smart to get trigger happy with someone like that, especially a two bit goon like Ihara. Nobody seen him since? Nope. I don't know if the cops are onto him yet, but he killed that creep right there in the middle of town. Only a matter of time before they figure it out. Are you holding up? You sound said you found Kimura, kind of more, right? Yeah. Right after I lost those Inu Siwa guys. In the end, I couldn't hold off. The hold of Arianaki, so I figured I'd head back to the office instead. Hello. Guys? Anyone here? Boss? I'm coming in. Boss? Boss, uh...
I see no... Is his head bashed in? I guess so. Why was he shirtless? Shut up, chair. Never got through to Araya Anaki. Wound up reporting the boss's death myself. Must have been rough on you. Apparently he got stab stabbed in the back and no real sign of struggle. That's not all, though. Cops think the killer might be a woman because of how they found him. A woman? Yeah, his shirt was off. And there were traces of lipstick on his neck and lips. So this girl came in promising action, gave Kanamura more action than he... And gave Kanamura more action than he bargained for. That's what it looks like. Though something doesn't add up. It's just, well... What's up? I got back to the shiny. Ari. Shiny. You gotta understand. When I got back to the office, it was completely empty. That just doesn't happen. Ever. True. True. You usually have one or two boys keep an eye on things out front, especially when the boss is in. Not only that, but... But... I don't know. The boss never seemed like the kind of guy to fall for that kind of trick. No matter the girl. No? He didn't really ever talk about women or anything. He wasn't exactly a spring chicken, if you get me. I hear you. You never know. Huh? Police are right, she must have been one hell of a woman. You ever heard of a femme fatale, Kido-chan? Femme fatale? What's that? Very special kind of woman. She might not be the most gorgeous girl in town, but you can't deny there's something special about her. This one, it seems like you've got her. She suddenly decides to keep you, keep you at arm's length. That only makes you want her more. Before you know it, she's the only thing you can think about. A girl, a girl like that will eventually lead you to ru total ruin. Maybe you'll find one on your own someday, Kido-chan. A woman so alluring, you can't possibly pull yourself away. Can't say I'd complain if I did. Enough about that, though. First things first, we've got we've got work to do. Work? <laughs> they. Shibata goons, if I had to guess. Probably here to haul us in. Ah. Isn't that right, boys? How's going on, Akiyama-san? You know, buddy. No matter what you do to us, the Inuo sail will still be on your backs. Uh, this is pointless. Guess we'll see about that. Sorry. Boss's orders. Hey, I'll buy you some time. Get out of here while you still can. Are you out of your mind? Nothing personal, but I can handle way more hurt than you can. Now go. Akiyama-san. I made you back at Sky Finance. You should be safe there. But just go. Okay. Oh there, you forget about someone? This ain't a game, asshole. Yes it is, it is Yakuza 4 Remastered. The only way you're getting this right is with a cutting board. Oh yeah? Pretty still material for a guy who does this for a living. I mean, who lops off fingers anymore? You think this is a joke? I've been dead serious from the word go. Don't be surprised when I hand you your, hand you your asses on a platter. Big words for a little man. Fine then, we'll show you how Yakuza do things nowadays. Pretty boy. Bring it on. No kid glove, boys. I want to see this fucker bleed. Get him. <coughs> Sorry about that. My throat's a little sticky. Probably should have some actual, like, water instead of soda near me, but you know what? Can't go back on that at this moment. We got fight happening. Okay, you have a sword. You have... Pop. Ow, ow. Pop, 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 pop. Come on. 
Nope, nope. Uh, of course. This is not tasers. Come on. Come on. Almost got the bro with the sword. the ground we can just oh wait do I have that active yes make sure it still works the same way That it does. Doesn't matter when uh, if you can't move and they just punch your heat right out of you. Try again. <clears throat> but we know it works. We just don't have the heat to fully support the. Oh, would you stop grappling me, you bastard? Unfortunately, I don't have a way to dodge through. Blade yet. Or block through blades. Where'd this horde go? Where'd the sword go? Did it get yeeted off the edge? Damn it. Okay. Okay. Using item now. Yes. Oh, wait. Exit amulet. That's a little bit of defense that I didn't have, but I have now, and that is what's important. Up, up, up. Up, 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 up. Ow. Really? On the rebound? Come on. Up. I don't know if that was the dodge our dodge attack that I was thinking it was, but... Okay. Uh, well, had enough? Damn it, we heard you were good, but we didn't know you were gonna be this good. That I have a reputation, at least. What else are they saying about me? You think you're so damn funny, huh? I don't know much, but... But what? We got boys. Heading to your office as we speak. No kidding. Tell me something. Are they as tough as you? Eh, there are. Top of the Shibata family heap. Perfect. 
And I got nothing to worry about. What do you mean? Yeah, <laughs> you'll see. How do you think you're doing? Oh, brother, just what I needed. Another Yakuza brawl, Akiyama? Really? Guess my warning didn't get through to you. Gucci san spare me. You can weave your arm all you want. No. I'd rather. Uh, and come on, I'm the victim here. Can it? I didn't ask for your opinion. Take him in, boys. Not today. Oh no. Oh no. Uh huh. Got in the. Okay. So at least quick turns can. Okay. Nope, 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 nope. Keep running. Keep running. Yeah, at least it's giving me. Ugh. I did not want to be doing this again. I thought I was done with running. Bullshit. Guess I'm too late. Ooh. Oh. Yeah, lucky bastard. He hit his head on the way down, and he's lucky to be alive. Honey, I'm home. Hi, Omizu. Mercy. Thank you. Thanks. I'm really gonna get it when they drag my ass downtown. Just back to business. Nothing new. And that was the end. Glad I separated it the way I did. So now we can move on to chapter three in after two episodes. So let's see, this is two, three. Episode five will be chapter three. I'm making this work. Slowly, but surely. Um, anyways, uh, if you guys are, you know, in enjoying the game so far, uh, a little, or if you're a little entertained that I have to do cutscenes, or you feel bad that I still have to do, or not cutscenes, but the chase scenes, or if you feel bad I have to do chase scenes, or if you're happy I have to do chase scenes, let me know if they comment. I know I am not looking forward to it. Um, while you're down there, leave me a like. Helps me out tremendously. And hit that subscribe button and that notification bell. So that way you know when more Yakuza is coming at you. That way you can see the shorts as they're popping up. Um, 
because we should have revelations here soon. Anyways, that's all I have for you guys today. Until next time.